Lady Marion. Oh, Sir Gisborne. My apologies. It is my intent to travel to London. It would be my honor if you would join me. The capital should be most amusing. Uh, I don't know. We are to have a strong guard. You need not fear for your safety. And your father has already given his consent. Truly? I should very much like to accompany you, Sir Gisborne. Thank you for inviting me. You're very welcome, my lady. You always think there's a trap. Quiet, men. Keep a lookout. Scum infest these trees. Good afternoon. I'll be having your valuables now. Surround him! Ah, I wouldn't do that. Shut! Oh. my way, Loxley. And miss all the fun? Hardly. How about we make this a game? Heads, you walk out of here. Limbs, you crawl. <laughs> all right, we do this like men. I don't have time for this. <laughs> Looks like Gisborne's brought us a nice gift from the sheriff. This should feed all of Nottingham for a month. And what's this? Let me see. My dearest friend and ally, Prince John, please accept this humble token from my coffers as a symbol of our new alliance. Understand that Nottinghamshire stands with you in whatever course of action you deem appropriate, and that you have our unflinching military aid. Should Richard ever return from the Holy Land, I have men ready to intercept him. May your reign be glorious and fruitful. Long live the true king, Sheriff de Lazy, Nottinghamshire. This is treason! The prince plans on usurping the king's throne, and the sheriff is backing him. And who knows who else could be behind this? Is the king coming back from the Holy Land soon? How is the sheriff planning on stopping him? Answer! Take him to camp. We'll have our answers soon. Robin, this man's been terrorizing Loxley. I know. Then you know he must die. What? How long until he makes an example of someone? My whole family's dead because of what he stands for. I know much, but... You don't know. You can't know. None of you know. The only way to end this is before it begins. Blood for blood. Calm down, much. We aren't doing this for your vengeance. Well, I am, and I will have it. From Prince John, from the Sheriff. From this man right here and now. You would not kill a defenseless knight. The soul of the Shire would come down upon you with fire and sword. 
The sheriff would hunt you down, even here in Sherwood. The sheriff and the sire are already on our backs. This would change nothing. This changes everything, Butch. The moment we start killing defenseless knights is the moment we become simple brigands, not the merry men. Keep your merry men. I'm here for blood. Back to camp. You need to cool off. Listen to your leader, boy. He speaks wisdom. And who asked you? The Saracen fighter for a free England. You're no friend of mine. Cool! Thank you, um... Robin. Robin Hood. And it is us who should be thanking you. Or at least Gisborne and the Sheriff. For they are feasting us tonight. <laughs> Dinner's on the Sheriff! <laughs> My lady, may I ask your name? Lady Marion, if it pleases you. Um, and if I heard right, you are Robin Hood, the bandit. I am Robin Hood, Lord Protector of Sherwood, and leader of this fine group of men. Formerly, I was known as Robin of Loxley, Earl of Huntington. My lady, I do not wish to pry, but what are you doing in such foul company? Sir Gisborne invited me to visit London with him. But did you say that you were a lord? And Robin, Earl of Huntington, no less? Indeed. So you have heard of my recent misfortunes. The official word is that you are wanted for murder and treason. And so your land and titles have been justly revoked. I am innocent on both counts. I defended my land from a cruel yet well-connected man. My only crime of treason is being loyal to a true king. Not whoever holds the sword at the time. It's a slot like Gisborne and Prince John and the Sheriff who tear this country to pieces. I don't know what to make of that. <laughs> 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 hey, a toast to our host, Robin Hood and the Merry Men. <laughs> I can understand, but here I am, dampening the mood of the feast. You enjoy yourself. I'm going to see if I can find my more Zealous, merry man, to see if he's calmed down a bit. Hey. Hey. Listen. About before. You said that your whole family was was dead. Have you received any word about your parents? Yeah. Bad news? When we left, they escaped to Leeds in Yorkshire. They were captured and delivered to the sheriff. I had them executed. Much. I'm so sorry. If I had known... There was nothing we could do. By the time I found out, they'd been dead for weeks. So you're gonna let them go, huh? He's born in the lot. Yeah. Why? Butch, these people are wrong, and they need to go down. But if we stoop to their level, your family, or friends, they will have died for nothing. 
I won't turn the Robin. I, I want. No one deserves revenge more than you, Much. Which is why, if you don't take it, it'll prove that you're better than the whole lot of them. It'll prove what we're fighting for. All right. Take him out of the forest, Robin. The sooner the better. I will. <laughs>